hello. It's often easier to make information available to visitors in the form of documents, rather than trying to recreate the information on a web page. Plus, they have something to take away with all your contact information on it as well. So, easily uploading and linking to documents is important, and this video will show you how to do this in WordPress. For linking text to documents, I begin by placing my cursor where I want the link to appear in my text, and then clicking Add Media. In this case, I'm adding the PDF from my computer, so I use the Upload Files tab of the Media Uploader window. When the upload is complete, my document is highlighted in the Media Library, and the attachment details are on the right side. By default, the title is the name of the file, but even if you have a good descriptive file name, it still needs to be altered to fit the context of your content. You could change the link text later in the content editor, but it's always a bit faster to do it from here. So, in the title field, put the text you want the visitor to read. The only other thing to watch for, when adding a document from your computer, is to be sure the file's URL shows properly in the link to setting of the attachment display settings. Remember, this area of the media uploader is often not visible, so, be sure to scroll down. If it does not say media file and show the URL of the document, just drop down the menu and choose media file. I'm now ready to click the insert into post button. The link displays in the content editor. If the wording of the link isn't right, you can change it in the content editor without going back and reinserting the document. When you finish, remember to update or save draft, or publish. Concerning the linking images to documents, there may be occasions in which you want people to click an image to download a document. Maybe you have a cool graphic to attract their attention to the download, and you want the file to be accessed when they click the graphic. Normally, when you insert an image, you either link it to itself or to nothing at all. But there is the option in the media uploader to link to a custom URL. This is where you would paste the URL of your document after getting it from the file's edit link in media library. In fact, you can upload all sorts of document files into WordPress, such as PDFs, PowerPoint presentations, Word documents, spreadsheets, and so on, but you should always be guided by the needs of your visitors. They want material to be accessible and safe. WordPress has a wide range of document file types that it enables, including most types of Microsoft Office files, OpenOffice formats, WordPerfect, and the Apple iWork format. I finished here the video, if you find it useful, subscribe for more video. Thanks and see you soon in the next videos.